Hello and welcome back. Now in this video we are going to discuss question number 7 from exercise 2.3. Now we have been given A plus I. The matrix A plus I is equal 1, 2, 0, 5, 4, 2, 0, 7, minus 3. These are the elements. And we have to find the product A plus I into A minus I. Okay. So the first step is we write down A plus I. Now the matrix A plus I is 1, 2, 0, 5, 4, 2, 0, 7, minus 3. Now how do we obtain A minus I? Now this is a very important step. So just be very attentive. A minus I could be written as A plus I minus 2I. Because I minus 2I gives minus I. So A minus I could be written as A plus I minus 2i. i denotes the identity or the unit matrix. Now we have the matrix a plus i. So we write down a plus i as it is. 1, 2, 0, 5, 4, 2, 0, 7, minus 3, minus 2 times the identity matrix of the third order. Since we are dealing with third order matrix, so identity matrix which has to be used must also be of the third order. So identity matrix of third order is 1, 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, 0, 1. Now we multiply 2 inside with all the elements that is called scalar multiplication. So A plus I remains as it is. We multiply 2 with each element and we get 2, 0, 0, 0, 2, 0 and 0, 0, 2. So we have a plus i and we have 2i. Now we subtract the corresponding elements. So 1 minus 2, then 2 minus 0, 0 minus 0, the first row. And 5 minus 0, 4 minus 2, 2 minus 0, the second row. 0 minus 0, 7 minus 0 and minus 3 minus 2, that is the third row. So we have finally found out the matrix A minus I which is minus 1, 2, 0, 5, 2, 2, 0, 7, minus 5. So we have A plus I, we have A minus I. Now we simply multiply the two matrices. So this one is A plus I, this one is A minus I. Now we multiply the rows with the corresponding columns. So R1 into C1, so that will be minus 1 plus 10 plus 0. R1 C2 will be 2 plus 4 plus 0, 2 plus 4 plus 0. Then R1 C3 will be 0, and then 4 and 0, 0 plus 4 plus 0. Then R2 into C1, that's minus 5 plus 20 plus 0, minus 5 plus 20 plus 0. Then R2 C2. So 5 2s are 10, 4 2s are 8, 7 2s are 14, 10, 8, 14, we add up. Then R2 C3, so that will be 0 plus 8 minus 10. Then R3 C1, 0 plus 35 plus 0. Then R3 C2 will be 0 plus 14 minus 21. Then R3 C3, so 0 14 plus 15. So finally, if we add this, we get 9. The second element is 6. Here it's 4. The second row elements are, now 20 minus 5 is 15. This total is 32. 8 minus 10 is minus 2. This is 35. 14 minus 21 is minus 7. And 14 plus 15 is 29. So this is the required product A plus I into a minus I. Like it, share it, and subscribe to our channel for more such interesting videos. Thank you.